Last week, Pastor Martin Hutchison of the Camden Community Garden stopped in to give us an update on the program that introduces children and their families to the joy of growing a garden and then enjoying the harvest. You could say the program was planting a seed that's going to grow into a love of fresh vegetables. Well, Delaware has a similar program geared towards seniors only they don't have to grow the vegetables. Kathy Jackson is the marketing specialist with the Delaware Department of Agriculture and joins us this afternoon to talk about this program. All right, so we're talking about the Senior Farmer Market Nutrition Program. What is it? It is a program that allows uh, seniors, low-income seniors in Delaware to purchase fresh fruits and vegetables as well as honey and cut herbs at farmers markets and on-farm markets throughout the state. Now, by doing that, we um, help our farmers and our farmers markets to grow because it provides a little extra income for them. And it also introduces some of our seniors that maybe have never shopped at a farmers market or an on-farm market to a great place to purchase fresh fruits and vegetables this time of year. This, this is a pretty new program. It is, this is our first year to operate the program statewide. Last year we ran it as a pilot program in a couple locations in the state. Yeah. So, so, yes. So how does it work? Uh, we have distributed vouchers to senior centers throughout the state and then those, those senior centers are vetting the seniors and providing the vouchers to the seniors and that's going on right now and then the seniors will take those vouchers, they get $30 um, in $5 coupons that they can take out to the farmers markets or the on-farm markets and spend and they can spend it um, all at once yeah. or they can spend five dollars every time they go and the vouchers are good through the end of October so they've got a nice long um, time to be able to purchase the kinds of fruits and vegetables that they like. Right so why? Why, why do you want to do this? Well we have some seniors that um, need the extra uh, money. Maybe they get um, you know, food aid from other sources, but right. getting fresh fruits and vegetables is a challenge because a lot of those other sources provide boxed goods or canned goods, so this allows them to get fresh fruits and vegetables. Yeah. It also introduces them to the farmers markets and the on-farm markets, and uh, our farmers get to interact with some great seniors and the seniors get to meet our farmers and it's just a win-win all the way well, around. Yeah, right. Now do you have to qualify to get the vouchers? You do. You have to be over 60, you have to be a Delaware resident, and you have your income has to be under 185 percent of poverty level which works out to be about $21,000 a year uh, if you're a single person or about $31,000 a year if you're a couple. Hmm. What, what if a senior can't actually get out to the farmers market to shop? We do have a provision where they can have someone shop for them that's called a proxy. So that all they need to do is fill out a, a, a little bit of paperwork that tells who that proxy is going to be. Gotcha. Okay, mm -hmm. so um, how do they get the vouchers? They will go to their senior center, to a local senior center. I would just recommend that they call the, either, if they're a member of a senior center, they probably already know about the program because they've mm -hmm. probably um, right. been uh, advertising it there. or call a senior center in their area and ask if they're participating and they can get involved. Um, they can also find a little bit more information on our website, which is uh, de.gov slash buy local. Hmm. Well, we sure put that on our website so everybody right. can find it. Yeah. And everybody's liking this program so far. Yeah, we've had some really great feedback, both from the uh, senior centers and the seniors themselves and also from um, our farmers and our farmers markets. Wonderful. All right, Kathy Jackson, thank you so much thank for the you. Delaware Department of Agriculture.